Well, would you look at this track here? It's kind of blown up. Which reminds me of the time when I asked a uh, train engineer how many times his train had derailed. And the train engineer, he said, well, it was hard to keep track. <laughs> <sighs> yes. Now, with that excellent joke out of the way, let's get back on track with the cast, shall we? Yeah, let's do it. In the red, fittingly, it is Lacey Wren playing as the Soviet Union. He's bringing along with him the twins. Can't separate these two here. Airborne guards. No, yeah, airborne guards. Air, airborne troop tactics. And then guard motor coordination. Followed by armored assault tactics. A commander that they've been growing on me. Mm -hmm. Now, he is up against oh, Monsieur Chiligard. Who has locked in an old school commander here, Lightning War? Oh, yes. This baby here used to be the meta for the longest of time. I have since fallen out uh, then in favor of, say, Spearhead, Jaeger Infantry, and. Well, there's another one that I'm thinking of here. Oh, well. Yeah. Can I get a word in on the bulletins? Laser rim, just buff for the conscripts, you know the deal. Faster reload, f faster fire, more accuracy, more diverse it is for a silica. Heavy machine gun earns veterancy faster and close fist, never leave hope without it. You know, Panzerfaust has increased range and last but not least, minefields and telemines that cost less munition. How much less? So four less for an S mine and three less for the Tela. Well, everything counts in large amounts. <clears throat> dang, dang, dang. He's yeah, he's heading down here to the cutoff point. The heavy machine gun, also following suit. He. You'll be able to get the decap. Now taking the point, uh, not the best place to set up there, but okay, that's that's good. I uh, I was afraid that the that the conscript would actually be killing the weapon crew. Not this time around, nope. Not this time around. Anyway, damage is done. And yes, I am in fact recording <laughs> for a second there, I thought, wait a minute, did I actually press record? That thing has, however, never happened when I just start blabbering without recording. That would be, that would be silly. All right, Pios. Yeah, got a couple of kills. Gonna get killed in return, at least. So I thought, I thought that'd be dropping another model here, but oh, lucky. Oh, looking to intercept here, but he is in the meat grinder here. Oh, could you guys just squeeze in there? Okay. And yeah, this engagement here is still going. Yeah. We are losing a sector. Thirty years later, <laughs> they're still shooting. <laughs> ah, there we go. Got a man. Well, that's it. Oh, oh even looking to intercept here on retreat. Oh, ah, sick parkour moves. Silagat displaying some French skills there. Is he gonna go for the rifle? No rifle grenade here. Yeah, okay, that, that would also be a very long range on that rifle grenade. Haha, <laughs> bait it! <laughs> Lazy Ren jumped right on in with both feet. Ah, 
finally capture at this point. Woo-hee! Yeah, light cover doesn't uh, give much protection against grenades. Oh! <gasps> Okay, let's not forget that mines can kill a maximum of two infantry units per squad. And guess what we see here? Two grenadiers. <sighs> at least they are split out, but I'm afraid what will happen at the retreat, because when, whenever you press retreat, they have a tendency to sometimes gather up in the middle and then set off. Ugh. <sighs> So if we see a grenadier wiped soon, then it's gonna be them hitting the mine. And no, I didn't want to sit and stare at them capping the point for eternity. Not when something else is going on. Like the 222 arriving and these... Oh my, another, another model drop there? Someone's lucky today. Ah, there we are. <laughs> And simultaneously, another mine hit over there. Oh. Dodge that one. Ah, well. Lazy Ren, he must be feeling quite good about himself. After getting that wipe. All right, bunkers ready. Yeah, if these guys just as much get spotted by the enemy, they'll just drop up to the ground. Just how low health they have. Okay, then. T-70. Let's roll. And we will roll. Hmm. Yeah, no grenades available here for laser rain. And this is this is strange. His build order tells me that he wants to go for guards, but he could call in guards now as he has free command points. And then again, he is lacking a bit of manpower, but still, is he not gonna lock it in? Because most of the time, or the meta Soviet build is uh, free conscripts, combat engineer, and a guard. And if you don't want the guard, replace them with uh, another conscript squad. Did the two, two, two. Yeah, two, two, two have done well. Seven kills so far. And then again, he could also lock in armored assault tactics now to get some benefit from the radio intercept. All righty then, we got LMGs on the way. Oh, what a nade there. Instantly retreat, he never saw it coming. Uh oh, and Lacey Wren. Has just secured double fuel. Now it goes for a siscon. Huh. And still no guards. It, yeah, I don't really think he will be going for the uh, airborne troops commander. Because he is swimming in munitions and he has just locked in guard motor. All right. There we are. He calls in the mortar? Okay, 120 millimeter. Mm -hmm. When you want the game to be balanced in your favor. No, oh, we got grenades unlocked. Sweet. Oh, we just lost the unit. 
Ziligav has lost his pioneer. No tech for him. And again, he also needs to escalate. But eh. it's quite early. Not like we're gonna see any medium tanks pretty soon. And we might not even have light tanks anymore. Yep. Ah. Pack gun shot flew right through. Okay. It's getting a little hot in here. Um. Yeah, the 222 is not going anywhere fast. It needs repairs. The Pioneers has arrived. They are making their way towards the uh, 222. I can tell on the minimap down here. Yeah. Nothing like getting brown pants. Thanks to the 120 mm mortar. Luckily, they didn't die. Well, maybe they sort of did due to shock. <laughs> Oh, hey, another one. Okay. <laughs> this time around, squad survives for retreating from this point. Okay. Osiligath, he is taking up, I can tell, because Panzer Grenadiers are not being trained at the moment. They are in queue. And I do like seeing Panzer Grenadiers. They are quite powerful. Maybe not as powerful as V3 Grenadiers at long range, but medium close range? Well, definitely close range. Medium range? Mm, don't really exactly know the uh, DPS curve. Oh, we do have guards now. 12 minute guards. Well... Oh, wow. What happened up there? Did the mortar strike or something? They got gipped. Hmm. Could also have been a mine, grenade. Oh, well. Hmm. Deja vu. Seem to recall another retreat here from the pilots, but however, this time around they actually lose this models. Oh hey! Look at that! Your cover is gone! Yeah, no no chance of them getting up there and capturing this point. It would have been nice, but the 2 to 2 would have made it not so nice. I heard grenade. And grenade it certainly did damage, but... They can be repaired for free. You guys are on the wrong side of the cow. Which is apparently getting well done. Ah, G43 rifles along with LMGs. Makes me wonder if he's gonna give G43s to his Panzer Grenadiers. Could be a good choice. Otherwise, Osiligav he has definitely been spending his munitions every uh, opportunity that he has gotten. On his uh, rifle grenades, mostly. All right, support armor corps ready. This thing here, 18 kill, yeah, doing well. I don't really think, yeah, this 120 millimeter uh, hasn't really been uh, killing it. Yeah, a mortar 
getting a wipe on a, on a squad that's retreating. That's infuriating. Didn't happen this time around though. Um, Lazy Ren, yeah, needs to check. And once he has done that, then he could push out a little T-34, but I suspect he'll be going for the big one, 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 one. Alrighty then, Panzer IV, but not to worry, Lazy Rin is prepared, he's got a Siskon, plus the guards, they can button, and the conscripts, they got their snares ready, snares at the ready! Sup, just passing by. Man, why are these guys sticking around? Hmm. Trying to get the middle, I'd guess. Uh, yeah, he's got the guards on the run. Machine gun almost ready. He's diving. He should be diving. He could be diving. The uh, AT gun here, which would mean that Lazy Rain wouldn't have any strong AT on the field. Plus the guards, they had just retreated. So, but no, okay, he's still he's still in it. Still here. Excellent push from a silly gaff. Really putting the pressure on the sis. But here comes the guards. Yeah, two to two could go down. No. Oh. Merge, he could do a merge there. Ops not to do it. He reinforces instead. And the silly gaff backs out of there. Man, if he could have gotten that sis gun destroyed who K that would have been uh, almost a GG these guys they're just waiting for some manpower so he can get the structure down and they got fed up waiting where are they going Because you should be retreating them uh, now and then build the structure. I'd say. Unless he's... Well, I don't know. If he builds the structure then he won't have any manpower for the T-34. But th still. <sighs> He'll soon have it. Ta-da! And here's a great case of why you should split out your troops. Uh, see, that was an expensive mistake there for Lazy Ren. Pretty much means that he is still without fuel because both his conscripts got suppressed. None of them could uh, flank this heavy machine gun. And here we see Ocelicath using proper um, MG tactics. You know, just moving it, shuffling it around a bit after it's been discovered. Okay, we got these men here. Let's get that uh, mechanized armor company down. And boy, yeah, Laser in he needs tanks. Because Osiligas, he's just been wiping the floor with him. Look at the VPs, plus 400. Almost below 300 here for Lacey Ren. Hmm. Wah, wah, wah. <gasps> <laughs> oh wow, Lazy Ren got fed up being the floor mop here. What? Lazy Ren, he just pressed the button, engage, and suddenly, well, he got a Panzer IV, a Grenadier, and another Grenadier! And thus, the road for the combat for Lazy Ren has been paved! Not to mention that he has the fuel for T-34. Lacking manpower, though. Hmm. So, he's back in it. 
Well, at least the two to two survived. Almost vet free. And look at all of look at all these bonuses it get at vet free. Maximum speed, rotation speed, acceleration, additional health, more accuracy for the uh, cannon, and more accuracy for the machine gun as well. Nope. Well, at least he's getting fueled back over there. Manpower-wise? Nope. Don't want the small one. Want the big one. Gotta shell out 80 more manpower for that. And Lazy Ren, okay. Spending his munitions at every opportunity to get those mines down. So far, Lazy Ren's mining is keeping him in the game. That mine, however, blew up. And here comes the Minesweeper gang. Gotta get those mines spotted. Lost enough squads to mines already. And just as he has gotten his fuel point under control, the 222 swoops in there, brushes them aside. Pioneer's gonna grab that point. By the way, we haven't seen any mines from Osiligath, I believe. Oh. And Osiligath, oh, he he's mad. He's going for the sniper now. And seeing as the sniper will most likely be hanging back, the risk of him stepping onto a mine is low. Mm, Panzer IV. Oof, getting close to a wipe here. Okay, he takes the risk. Goes in here, but hey, backed up by all this, hardly a risk. Turns the corner, finds the grin. Squish, squish, squish! <laughs> squish, 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 squish. Yeah. <laughs> Vasilikas must be fuming right now. Or maybe not. He is a, from what I've seen at GCS3, a rather calm, a calm guy. Very chill dude, but I've only seen one man to never rage. And that's what Ivan. Never seen him rage. Though I have one time heard when he uh, rage quit it and shut down his stream, but I didn't see it myself. That was after a day of being sniped by another player. Hmm. But yeah, that's the thing. We all have our limits. Oh, like this T-34. How lucky can you get? And the 120 millimeter retaliates in the way it's knows best sheer destruction in the hut exit oh burn those flames yep wow um yeah sniper there is he gonna die to us water not quite Yeah, this building won't stand for long. Sniper still standing after getting hit. Hmm. Oh, that's a DP that was dropped. Doesn't have anyone. Well, maybe the pioneers. Yeah, the pioneers can pick up the DP, and then he can repurchase the DP for his uh, his guards. But then again, if they go up there, they'll take so much damage. On them but I think they'll be able to steal it and there is also the risk of getting uh, bombarded but Silicat doesn't know that Lazy Rain can't afford the light artillery barrage <clears throat> oh, yeah can't afford the uh, the replacement either so probably have to pick that up wash away some of the blood and gore that may be on there oh 
Yeah, they were in a hurry to pick that up. Didn't even get the last guy on. He's still sitting in the, the uh, support weapons company or something, just chilling, enjoying a glass of uh, vodka. That's it for my refreshments. And I hope you too are enjoying this match with whatever um, you may have at your disposal. Whether you're eating dinner, getting ready for bed or studying. Go pew. No pew. The is at risk. -hoo -hoo. Well, the mortar here is certainly trying to get rid of him. Got him down to half health. Not bad for a mortar. <laughs> and the sniper is like incendiary around before he leaves. Just a little something to remember him by. Checking in over here. It's just a Panther 4. Okay, Lazy Ren wants double fuel. Who doesn't? Only two kills on the, the uh, heavy mortar. It's not really its day today, is it? But then again, the silly guy only has two weapon team weapons on the field, so uh, not a lot of uh, stationary targets here. Yeah, there we go. Double fuel secured for lazy Ren. Panther 4, what are you doing? You can't catch a territory. That's silly. That's silly, a silly guy. Sniper in the open, not to fear. There is no counter sniper on the field. Oh, pushes him forward. Not sure that's intentional. What can he see here? Oh, right. Come on, UI. There we go. <sighs> well, without spotting scopes, it has a good view. Nice uh, range on the view. If they get spotting scopes, they can see forever. <laughs> Now the pack has arrived. Alrighty then. Gonna need all the help you can get against these beefy T-34s. Enemy forces oh. Spotted again. Not to worry, he's still alive. that mine there leaves it maybe to finish later mm. just like leftovers mm. now I'm thinking about pizza and I do apologize if you too are thinking about pizza right now <laughs> because pizza mm, that's good what's another mine here come on you've been spotted it's a little too optimistic <laughs> wow there we go speaking of going the T-34 gets going miss miss okay a little bit of flanking there on one of the packs yeah silly gath is losing points fast that triple cap there is doing lazy rin so good But nine pop cap, you can't squeeze out a tiny one here. That's ten pop. Good go for a maxim. But then again, this bad boy is on the field. Nine. Okay. Could be that the Soviet sniper is also nine. So if he wants to be cheeky, he could back tick and get snipers himself.
Meanwhile, with Silicath, well, what could he use? He could use some indirect fire of his own. Panzerwerfer, maybe? Well, he's got the tech. Yeah, he can't call in the tiger. Popcap won't allow it. So a Panzerwerfer would... Would be a choice. A good choice, I'd say. Unless... Nah, he could also just go for uh, more Panzer Force. Oh! Sniped by guards and suddenly Popcap is not an issue in regards to the Tiger. Could we perhaps see how many kills on the sniper? Nope, he's not here. He is not among the mentioned. That's a bit sad though. Really wanted to see how many kills he had racked in. Lazy Ren, can he squish in the caddy? Certainly not when his men are reinforced. Yeah, Popcap can get it. The Katusha. Is it really necessary with the Katusha? Well, Katusha is more likely to uh, get a D crew in a, in a volley. It fires quite fast compared to the mortar, which is, you know, single shilling when it barrages. Not enough resources. So apparently you don't need the heavy panzer corps in order to get the tiger on the field. At least for the austere. I do believe for Oppo Commander Vest you need to have the panther authorization in order to call in the regular tiger. Not the king tiger. <laughs> then you just need to have had it at one point. Yeah, looking at the lack of Panther Force in production here, Silicatus is definitely going for the, uh, the Tiger. And hey ho! Katusha! Oh, no, 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 he's, he's retreating into it! But yeah, he, he was kind of doomed. Lazy Ren here, inches forward, and Silicatus, yeah, he's, he's... He lost his pack guns. Excellent, um, poking! That was a strong poke from Lazy Ren. And the Silicath, he just got caught. The enemy is attempting to steal our sector. This tiger here is still more than a minute away in regards to fuel. Oh. Man, a Silicath. Don't lose your Panzer Force. It's what you got going for you at the moment. The Panzer Force promoted. Yeah, both of them can blitz now. Hooray! Still a minute in terms of fuel, because, you know, he's gonna lose this here and further lowers his... <laughs> further lowers his fuel income, the never-ending minute that he needs. And now he goes for another pack gun. Yeah. Might be good, might be good enough in terms of uh, hitting the resources needed at the same time here. Boy, he... Yeah, well, at least he got the guard squad in return. They did. Bundle. Got the fuel, manpower soon to follow. In a minute. Always in a minute. 
There it is. Come on, click it. What's the legacy? Yeah, there we don't go. Now we go. Tunnel vision by Osilicath, maybe? Cancels. And yeah, here we go. Tiger on the prowl. First casualty, that bush. Had it coming. Only one window here. That's green cover. Where's that artillery landing? Oh, all the way over there. Yeah, infantry is retreating. But uh, let's see how the tiger deals with this situation. Okay, so far so good. T-34 knows it's outmatched. Backs off for now. One Panzer IV goes in. Stop! Oh. Oh, no. oh, it's Lazy Ren and his mines. They have just been absolutely brutal. There is a Panzer IV. That could provide some cover for the limping tanks. Is he going to dive here with this Panzer IV since he's calling in skill planes? Attacking vehicles only. Da -da 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 -da. Little bit of damage. Oh, that thing got hold I need some res repairs they are heading over there Katusha not ready to fire yet laser in I don't think he can squeeze in an issue yeah too much uh, on the field already but an issue 85 would have would be so good here even though he's got two uh, assist guns because the SU-85 self-spotting anti-tank gun. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Don't don't go inside that building. You could easily die if the roof collapses, though the roof doesn't exactly look heavy. <laughs> 100 points remaining. Yeah, Lazy Ren has turned this match around all starting from uh yeah what what happened yeah the panzer four and two grins uh, dying then afterwards it's just been downhill for Siligath. he has been trying to come back with uh you know with the tiger but then before he could get the tiger on the field he lost two anti-tank guns crippling his uh, at power and also forcing him to invest Yet another 300. Yeah, 320 for a new pack. Mine, mine. Well, Silly Gas seems to be using his tanks as minesweepers. Which is, uh, under some circumstances, A OK. -okay. Come on, baby, let's see those shots. No. He's dead though, and that Panzer IV missed the T-34. Tiger is good to go. Come on! Oops. What's that? Yeah, I don't know if it that... Oh no! Nope, it was just a weapon crew that ran away apparently. I just saw an icon disappear up there. Uh. Come on, Osilagas, stiffen your resolve! Oh no. No, 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 no. That's a good bundle. Almost took out both anti tank guns. <laughs> Nervous laughing. Still marked. Oh, no, no damage on the tiger there. <gasps> Come on. Can he get that conscript squad dead? But this is mine territory. There's a mine up there. I think that's the only one. <sighs> and this Katusha is wide in the open. Not spotted, though. Not spotted. <gasps> Here comes that one. Four. 
Still not spotted that Katusha. <laughs> there we go. Finally, order has been given. Um, could destroy that. Should destroy it. Pack gun could destroy it. T-34, T-34, T-34. Lazy Ren is not messing around. And Osiligasco for a two... 250 half track can he blitz away will he get lucky lucky tiger he needs to smite while the iron is hot only one t-34 remaining clean up initiated 30 vps left for silly gath is he turning this around Getting rid of that one little T-34 on the way. It's gonna be, it's gonna be tight though. Osidagath is risk getting swarmed here by T-34s. And these guys are not repaired. Both of them retreating back to base, meaning no repairs are available for these tanks here. And still, Os okay, destroyed. Maybe he wanted to keep it for himself. Risk sending the Tiger forward. There are no Sis guns though. Two T-34s. Mark target going in. Lots of misses. And a hit. Oh, an abandonment. Oh, yeah, yeah. He conscript squad down though. Dead, 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 dead it here. There is no other AT. He could go inside the Tiger and get another shot. But I think this is GG. Oh, my goodness. Oh. Game over for a Siligath. he came so close to turning this around but uh, sadly no sadly no uh, yeah maybe another pack instead of a Half track here would have done him wonders. <sighs> Playback over. What a um, chaotic ending here. I'd say that deserves a like, doesn't it? Mm hmm. GG, good match. Um, don't forget to subscribe if you already haven't. And if you thought this was uh, the big bad sucks rocks, then leave a dislike. And I'll see you wonderful people later. Have a good night, day, afternoon, morning, whatever. And if you're one of those classy people who likes to watch stats, then I got stats here for you. Lots of killing for uh, Siligath. But yes, Let's move on to something more graphics. Graphs. Yeah, he was on top again, but whoop and whoop all the way down here. So, Laser in. as we saw, took the victory. <laughs> yeah, he could also afford to queue up three T-34s. <laughs> oh my. Point cell, Osiligath dominating. And around the just before the 28 minute mark. Doesn't appear it was when he lost that much. But it was when Lazy Ren got into high gear and started to dominate in terms of map control. Alright, that will be all for the stats. I'll see you wonderful people later. Have a good one.